What should you think of Utopia? Utopia, the album. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to be honest. I haven't listened to the whole thing. Same here. But it's fire, though. It's fire. I, I only got like halfway through. I only, I, I, the, the, I'm only listening to the first five songs. Why? I just can't make it through. <laughs> yo, yo, that's crazy. I just can't make it through the whole, the whole playlist. So what I do is whenever, I, okay, I'm like, okay, let me listen to Utopia. Mm-hmm. I put the first song, like in order. And then after maybe like the five, six song, I'm like, okay, let me do some shit. It's wow. Like that. I thought it was a case where like you repeat the songs. Like, you know, like the first five songs are the ones that like you got stuck on. Oh. Which happens to me. Like, you know, like sometimes you'll be listening to an album and then like this one track is so fire that like you just put it on repeat. Yeah, fair. It you does happen a lot to, even. Yeah. A lot. Yeah. I think that happened with Sirens. Sirens on, on Utopia. That was a fire song. Oh, well, Sirens. Sirens and I know. I know. For me, personally. I like all the Kenya songs. Mm-hmm. The Kanye songs. Yeah, the Kanye songs. Is Kanye on the album? No, nah, he's not. But, it's but, just but what production. do you mean the Kanye songs? Because he gave them to Travis. <laughs> like Follow God. Is it Follow God? No. No, it's Thank God's God country. and God's Country yeah. and the other one. What's it called? Tele, tele- Telekinesis. Yeah, telekinesis. Yeah. I thought you meant <laughs> the Kanye oh, songs. Oh, shit. So yeah. I was like, oh, damn. Niggas actually are saying You know, that. funny enough, actually, two of those songs leaked. What? On Utopia? No, on on on, on Don the Tomb. Oh. I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm not like a, a big Kanye West yeah, I'm fan. I'm such a huge Kanye fan. Though. Yeah, that's oh. for y'all niggas. I'm a Drake boy. When that what? shit, when that shit came out, I was like deep into CLP. What? Yeah. Till yeah. today, I still don't know how the CLP sound. I'm a certified lover boy, man. Oh, that, that's why, that's why you be broken. Yeah, you be doing them broken hearts all the time. Hey, bro, you got to, yeah, and there. You know, somebody there. said Amari, Amari, Amari has like a phase where, where he's heartbroken. That's how, that's how he's able to come up with the hit. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. <laughs> I mean, think about it. Someone so. once said, someone once said, someone has to break his heart again. And I was like, that's crazy. Yeah, that think yeah. That. Like, yo, why? But think, but think about it, though. No, like, content comes from like different places. And I guess with that, when like you're in a relationship or whatever, and like it ends, there's a lot to like speak on. I feel like with me, I don't really always have something to say on a song when I'm in the relationship. Oh, you know what I mean? But like maybe when I'm out of it, I could have a whole lot to say, even about things that I would think when I'm in the relationship. You overlook the red flags. Yeah. Yeah, you yeah. know that thing. You have. I would just keep fun. moving, boy. <laughs> no, but not not even like that. Like you know, like after the relationship, I can still say good things about the things that happened then. Like oh, if yeah. there's good things, if there's nice things that happened, of which there kind of always are. I won't lie. Fact. So you can kind of still. I think it's like in the moment you can't really just speak about it on a song. It's not like that. For oh, me, yeah, at that least. makes sense. Yeah, so you have to like live through it, let it sit, let it simmer, you know, get over it. And it's like, I bet. This is about right. Put it on a song. Hey, but yeah, I've seen that. That was a crazy comment. I was like, fuck, what do you mean, bro? What do you mean? You, you want me to go through pain so I can be able to give you a banger? It's crazy. Very crazy. Yeah. And let's start the show. Are we live? All right. Are we being live? Are we being? Oh, <laughs> As the dinner was happening, ah, uh, you know what time it is. Bobby Lamine is here. Lindelani Similani is here. The director is here. The whole team is here. How you feeling, my brother? Hey, bro. Oh, this is the man who thought it was love. And the <laughs> hand just wanted uh, free tickets to the event. <laughs> he thought it wasn't hard enough. Eish. Until Eish. he got a call sign from Chase. The Eish. man who needs... To be heartbroken in order for him to make proper songs. <laughs> <laughs> this is the man uh, <laughs> who's yeah. got the country shook right now. Shout out, bro. He going crazy. Shout out, shout out, shout out, shout out, shout out. Yeah, the heartbreak kid. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. It's not like that. But I'm good, bro. How are you? I'm chilling, man. I'm so, chilling. Yeah, yeah. It's been, it's been a chop. It's been a the chop. The whole day has been a chop. <laughs> and she said to deal with the worst. It's been but we show. live now, you know. Mm. We live. Yeah. How you been, bro? See, so you've been bro. working, man. 
we're you just, know we're just trying to put the the music together put some content out oh yeah you know, get some some shit going that's really what i've been up to it's really what i've been trying to it's my focus i don't lie right now that's oh, yeah? it nothing else you're just waking up every day and doing it yeah you got to try something every day is a, a better opportunity to Fair. do you know Fair. something so Every day you try, you get it together, make a song, make a beat, anything. Could be anything, literally. You could learn something. So um, I'm kind of in a, a time where this is like a full-time thing. Oh, yeah. So kind of got to press the gas before like it gets to a point where people are like, yo, you need to... <laughs> you need to go flip a burger case to the song right now. It's quick, fast. Damn, man, that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> but I ain't trying to get there. So you gotta push the work hard, man. Bro, where's the project, man? The project. Where is the project? One music video. You're doing good. Four singles. Four singles. Four singles. Four singles. Come on. Come on. Come on, next man. Week, next week. Next week. Makes five. Oh, yeah. ah, I forgot jump. Yeah. And, and the other one. The first one. The, the first, first one. one. Yeah. That was accusations. Thought it was love. Yeah. Never be a thing. And then jump. And then jump. No, yeah. And next week. So another, another song. Right, so let's we'll go, see. man. We'll see. We'll hey, let's see. go. Then visuals, obviously. We're in the process of that. So I wanted, what I wanted to do is actually um, get the visuals out of the way. And then I'll give a project. Oh. Yeah. So most certainly September, project we or inside. Ah, uh, project level. Inside, we inside. Inside, inside. But not, not the deep one yet. Not the deep <laughs> one yet. We're still having fun. We're still, you know, trying to, I guess, not be too deep about the music. Not the heartbreak level. Not the heartbreak level. <laughs> yes, bro. Not you the go, heartbreak level. You yes. go easy this time. Yeah, you got to have some fun, bro. Because also I realized I was like, as you know, I like to perform like in that manner, you know, it's like we're rocking, not like I'm not trying to sit down and, yeah. you know, grab a stool and tell people, you know, hey guys, if you, if you're with your lover right now, you know, <laughs> grab her hand, you know, <laughs> put, her, put your hand up. Put, put your, your hands lover. in the sky. Yeah. So that's not really, <laughs> that's not an everyday thing. <laughs> so it's like, I need those records. I need to put stuff like that out as well because I have them. There's nothing stopping me from doing it. So. That's the period of time we're in now. Me, yeah, I'm waiting for the jam challenge, bro. Hey, boys, it's, we're trying to we're trying to make it move somehow. Yeah, so let's have the jam challenge, dog. Let's they have not, the jam they, challenge. They, they the mommies, bro. The mommies Yo, if you're watching this, bro, please do the jam challenge. Got to come with the with the jump. You got to make it jump. <laughs> you got to make it jump. Okay, what you doing? <laughs> Don't be scared. The thing is, I feel like people definitely might might be scared of doing these things. You know, yeah, no key, man. Yeah, yeah, and it has to start at home, and home is kind of tricky. You know, home is like a place where someone's gonna see you, show it to your mom tomorrow, and it's like shit, <laughs> ah, shit. But I mean, I mean, I mean, we do live in the. I mean, if they can do the 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 paper challenge, that that paper song, they can do that challenge. I think it's not the same thing. You see, with that, it looks like you know something African, Ganti, the 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 hip hop. Um, notion or like the way women are viewed in hip hop is a little bit different, in my opinion, at least. I don't know what you think. Maybe it's like that. But don't you think that I feel like I don't you feel like they do that thing to themselves, like women themselves, like, like not like women, but like the the female who actually do me who actually do hip hop. Yeah, no, no, they know what they're doing. I'm just saying, like to like the elders and all of that. You know, they think, hey. This is weird, you know what I mean? But like, we all understand what it's about and we know what it is. So it's, it's not weird to us, like Gen Z kids and, you know, the youth or whatever. But I think the only reason why people wouldn't be doing that all the time is because it's like, still got to go home, you know? Like, yeah, still got to go home, touch base, dead buzzy. And that's crazy. Wash the dishes. Hey, yeah, you still gotta wash the dishes. <laughs> still gotta wash the dishes, cook some food. Still gotta wash the dishes. For sure. Yeah, so that's what's up. But people must do it. For sure. Let's people do it, man. Do it. Let's you do must it. start. You must start for us. Nigga, what? Start for us. <laughs> start for us. <laughs>
Do a little dance. Come with a daddy. Don't oh, twerk. No, that's oh, yeah, what I mean. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe we can try. We can try to come up with, what with you some, some dance. What you know? consider it? Because you were sitting there thinking, yeah, I got a twerk. Now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, niggas been twerking. Niggas, 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 don't twerk, please. Dance. If, if you a nigga and you did the Blando Challenge, hey. which lipstick do you wear? Oh, oh no. Oh, What's no. the name of your lipstick, oh, poison? No. Nah. Stay the dog. What? <laughs> Ace hey, bro. Nah, that's that's a straight. Here's like, my problem. That's so hard on niggas. Here's my problem. Niggas are gonna take that on personally. Here's, Yo. here's my problem. Mm-hmm. You see, if you're a nigga. Mm-hmm. And 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 you drink brutal fruits. <sighs> brutal fruits is nice, dog. Come on, bro. What are you saying? Yo, you can't be a nigga and drink brutal fruits. So bro. I have to drink a strong ass. What? No, a, not really strong. Label? You can you can you can do Savannah. You can do that's Savannah. Still, that's still for the babies, no? Yeah, but that's the that's what I mean, though. Why? Okay, if you want to drink brutal fruit, why don't you just buy an 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 an, an aquila, dog? Just drink that. Ah. That's the, what guys say, but they don't know that like women know what they're doing with those drinks. They get more drunk than we do. Six of those things, ah, you're in a different place than a guy drinking a black label right now. I'm telling you. I don't care what you say. The Zamalek level. Ah, that thing will knock you down, bro. I put night. A savannah will put you on your ass. No, no, no. Even I don't I don't I'm not sure if I I'm on I'm on that. They don't know what the vape level. Yeah, I'm not sure. Hey, bro, people got to do something, you know? Some people vape because they don't smoke, like, cigarettes. Or weed or whatever, but they yeah. want to smoke. You know, people that smoke hardly. What are we saying about that, then? <laughs> <laughs> what are we saying about hardly, then? If you're a nigga and you smoke hardly, tell us. Damn. What's, what's the name of your thong? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, yo, yo. Even I'm catching strays at this race. <laughs> hey, because yo. No, nah, I'm just, I'm just jo- It's just jokes. It's just a joke. Ah, friends. it's just, just jokes, my friends. Yeah, but anyways, tell me, bro, you what should, what you think, what you think of the, of the, of the hip hop scenery in the, in the country? Um, it's, I, I do feel like it's, it's, it's in its growing phase. Oh, yeah? Um, in terms of the artists, I guess. On the back end of things, mm. um, people are making the music, people are getting the opportunities. The media is also kind of coming around that. Because not so long ago, there was the whole Hype magazine, um, Swazi coverage. Nah. Right. And that was, was that, was that the first one or was the second one? I think it was the second one. I'm not too sure. But they did something based on the Swazi scene, right? I saw you on that hype shit, though. Yeah, and then they did the hype shit. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Yeah, post up. That shit was crazy, bro. You gotta put it on. But they did that that hype shit, right? And I think since then, bro, well, not even since then, but that was proof of the fact that we're actually going somewhere and we're taking it to a certain place, I guess. You know what I mean? Angani, angani, ne? Yeah, so I think it is growing. I don't know about about uh, the industry aspect of it, you know, and the events and uh, it's at a different level, boys. Because I do feel like the music is going pretty well. I'm not gonna. And the music is good. Yeah, it's going really, really well. And it's it's literally, it's literally like I feel like the most people who are consistent this year is hip hop artists. Yeah, no no lie. True, but also. Besides hip hop artists, who would you say would have been consistent? House artists, maybe. No, like I'm just asking. I'm just asking. I'm just saying. House like, would it have been house artists that are consistent? So I'm a piano artist. I'm a piano. I'm a piano artist. Yeah. Do we have like that many of them? That's also another thing. We do have we besides do, Uno and uh, Captain because they also they got the shit running. Yeah, they got the, they got the shit on like artists, not DJs. Yeah. I, I mean, we do have a piano artists because some of them even sing. You know, they do that vocal thing. Mm-hmm. But the vocal thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> nah, nah, I, I see. But like, um, like who? Name job. Yeah. Is this boy called Sinatra? You know Sinatra? Nah. 
Boys Hard. Nah, I've never heard of him. Oh, Boys yeah. Hard. I've heard of that uh, Croc Nova guy. Is it Croc Nova? I, I don't know that bro. Damn. Is yeah. this bro got featured on I City song? For God I think that's name. him. Yeah, probably. The one with that's the Solani him. song. Is it? Who did the Solani song? Yeah, the one that sings on it. Is it that? Because there's a guy that sings on this, that, that oh, stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah, him. That's him. Yeah. He's, he's pretty clean with it. Yeah. But that's, that's almost the only vocalist. And then there's the rappers. Do we call them rappers also? It's <laughs> rap, right? It's rap. It's rap. What? <laughs> it's rap. Is it not rap? It's not rap. <sighs> Yeah. <laughs> right, let's call it rap. Let's call it's it rap, rap. for I the sake of the people. Rap. Let's call it rap. I think it's rap because niggas write down, you know, they come with the bar, the flow, you know, the rhymes. You got to do the whole thing, you know, the punchlines. Oh, yeah, also. Okay. The punchlines, they don't, okay. they punch him more, but they're not as hard as Floyd Mayweather's. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, yeah. 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 Um, yeah. 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 niggas are catching strays today. <laughs> Damn, yo, damn, 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 that's crazy. There, there aren't that many that we can identify. But I feel like you see the ones that or we have. Or at least me, I, let me not say we, because I'm not, I mean, I, I'm not really in touch with that side of yeah. the game type shit. So mm-hmm. that's why I was asking, like, who's out there? Because if you're saying uh, this year it's been hip hop that's been consistent, what has been consistent the other years? Or if it wasn't for hip hop, what was going to be consistent? Ooh, damn. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay, I see what you want. Was it going to be R&B? Like there's consistent r and music what you right want. now? Or, because there's still, I feel like there's still a lack in every other aspect because when was the last time you had like an R&B drop? Yeah. Ear drop. Who? Ear. You know Ear. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. The one that was at Boys just now. Yeah. yeah okay, bad, bad, bad. Yeah, she dropped. Okay, let's go. Who else? Yo. Nah. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> <laughs> let's go, let's go. Come in another one. Poloche dropped. Is that R&B? <laughs> Come on. That's Poloche dropped. That new fa. <laughs> That's contemporary music. We're not going to say. But. Uh, it's R&B. But we, okay. Now we uh, and we, I guess. Yeah, but but okay, yeah. I Mzua, mean, you got a point. Mzua drop this year. I think. I think he did. He the video. Villain yeah. Sini. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Villain Sini drop? dropped. Drop, I think she's. Yeah, she dropped something. Okay. Um. But when was this? Also. I don't know. I think hey, too much back. It's crazy. I'm just saying. Oh, like there could be the same level of consistency. In the other genres as well. Nah. Yeah, I think it's very possible because it's just a matter of there's there's more artists that are coming out and are within the spaces that allow us to be able to see them. Like when it comes to as the audience, because like, it's not. I'm not even saying it as people behind the curtain, but as the audience that that's watching, I think you can definitely have more at this rate. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we definitely need more of those. And we, we actually need more of everything, you know? Oh, there's also I Love Madonna. I don't know oh, if y'all have heard. Oh, well, yeah. Have y'all heard of that I Love Madonna? Hard. Boy, that, that, it's it's hard. Crazy. Yeah. It's hard as yeah. hell. So that's R&B drop as well. And then Bruno the artist. Yeah, Bruno. Yeah, Bruno. that's, that's Bruno that one shit, song though. I heard. Yo, that, that was crazy. <laughs> Yo, that one was crazy. Did you actually do something with it? Hey, bro, I actually couldn't. Because, um, I don't know, there was an issue about mastering it again. Oh. So it was like, it's already almost done. So we got to let it go. But surely we're going to do but something But you and Bruno can cook up some dope shit. Ah, definitely, bro. After I heard that, I was like, shit, it's crazy. Because yeah. initially he sent me like something that was like, um, how can I put it? It was like an experimental song, like on some Childish Gambino vibe. Oh, okay. Um, something like... Yeah, I, th- I think it was along those lines. It was like R and B ish. Yeah, but like, I I was like, shit, I have to like understand it. Like when I'm like in the studio, I need to like see what it really is, how it comes around, and then where I can fit and which pocket I can go into. Nah. That was really it. But it was dope as hell, though. Don't get me wrong. Except it was sick. We're halfway into 2023, bro. Mm-hmm. Uh, 
how it's been how it's been the year what it's you been think dope. I, we know we know you've been glowing but tell us more <laughs> <laughs> um, i think ha- i i spent half of the year literally just like i guess learning bro that's that's all i did i yeah. just spent half of the year chilling and reading and trying to understand what it takes to um, be an artist in this day and age because everything changes as time goes on you know, now content is not the same it's not like you're just gonna put out artwork now and say hey guys i just dropped a song you know it's not like you can just keep it as as it was like three years ago so now it's like learning how to roll out in in this um, current state of social media. Now there's new apps. Now there's the, all of this, you know. You kind of have to reset and see where your pocket is. Because now we haven't like made it yet. Right. So it doesn't make sense for us not to be exploring how we could. Nah. So yeah, I, I took a lot of time just doing that. Learning how to mix and master as well. Oh yeah? Yeah, so I could also be able to handle my own music. I need you, I need you to teach me how to, how to use Waves. Hey, bro, that's it's a simple chat. I won't lie, but like, um, if you really want to get like top, 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 which like, ones do you have? Do you have like the thirteen? No, I have twelve. Twelve, yeah, waves twelve. But, 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 I did like the there's a waves course on the net on the actual waves yeah, site. Yeah, yeah, I saw yeah. that. So it was kind of interesting because it teaches you, um, kind of what every plugin does, and individually. Yeah, and how it sounds. Because that's also another shit. thing. Also, the chains, your order in which you're putting your VSTs, mm. you know, all of that stuff really comes down to the final sound, right? And they tell you, this is why we designed this specific plugin. This is how we made this. And this is how it's going to sound on this vocal. So you can learn how to mix content. You can learn how to mix vocals for hip hop, R&B, rock, EDM beats as well everything yeah so yeah. i just did that course also during that six months oh yeah yeah so i've, I've just been doing shit like that man to be real oh, yeah? now it's like i don't know why i'm just chilling so <laughs> let's, gotta go hard though. let's let's put let's put the music out but like i i, I honestly feel like you you're one of the few local artists that actually know how to roll out yeah yeah, like your rollout is with Amari roll, rolls rolls out a song. There's no way you're not gonna hear about it. Yeah, I think it's important, bro. Like, how, like, like, what's what's the what's the what's the niche? Presentation sometimes exceeds the product. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Not not okay. Let me not say it exceeds it, but it is also a very important part of the product and how people receive it. Because if people see your work. And it's just presented in a weird way. Your quality is bad. Uh, it's not interesting. It's not funny. Whatever. You know, if, if you're a content creator and your content isn't engaging or wants you to watch more, right. then really, to be honest, you could get to the actual video and the actual thing is rubbish. Nah. But you got there because I led you here with the presentation mm. so i think that's important it's very very important can people read it can people see it can people listen to it now it's different because people have to see and hear at the same time right. yeah it's not it's no longer just about telling people and typing it out hey this is what i'm on this is what i'm doing there you go now people want to see what you're saying now people want to see that little tiktok you know, just to watch and hear your song. Niggas blow up on TikTok every single day, literally based on, I put a video out and I had the song playing. Crazy. People read the lyrics of the song and here we are now. You on TikTok? Yeah, for sure. I'm on everything, bro. You can find me on Tinder too. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm playing, I'm playing. I'm playing, <laughs> I'm, playing. I'm not no. on Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> fuck that, fuck that, fuck that. I would never. That would be that would be like bottom of the bottom. But I'm on everything, man. Gotta you gotta I see expand. I see I see you've been do I see you've been doing the uh your daily YouTube cooking. Yeah, 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 yeah. For sure. Yeah. For sure. 
That shit's fire, man. No, shout out, shout like, out, shout out. What, 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 what's, what's the, what's the, what's the, what's the main plan behind it? Do you have like a, is it just creating content as an artist or is, is, is engagement? Um, no, 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 not ish. a bit of both. Oh yeah. To be honest, but to be real, uh, certain artists that I listen to, um, like Wiz Khalifa, for instance. I I really used to like listen to Wiz Khalifa like a lot, right? Yeah. But what made him more interesting to follow was that he had content that had been running since way before the time he had black and yellow and all of that type of stuff. Yeah. So you can see like, oh, okay, this is where you're at. It's That's like growing up with yeah, it's the like person. growing up with an artist. So I thought it would be an interesting thing to do for people that would like to follow the journey, be it now be it in 10 years, like you're still going to go back and find it. I don't think I'll ever stop making the the vlog. It'll always be a thing. So it's like, even in like 10 years, I'll still be doing the vlog series, you know? And it's like, today I was at Coachella. <laughs> today I went to the Grammys and I won. <laughs> you know, today, best hip hop album. Yeah, I won best hip hop album. Not best African hip hop album. <laughs> Best hip hop album. <laughs> so know the like, difference. Yeah, I'm. I'm really trying to take it far. So that's what it is. But like, but like, do you think? Do you think as as locals, we need to use YouTube uh more? Or yeah, for sure. Is for is, sure. It, is it? I feel like okay. Let me say. It, let me put it like this. I feel like YouTube is something that we need to be grasping a lot mm-hmm. more than cannot be not not saying more than, but like. It should be one of those things. If you're creative and you don't have a YouTube channel, mm-hmm. like posting daily content. Yeah. Okay, yeah. you may not post daily content, but just have something that's going on. Mm. You know, in order for you to actually have that 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 consistency in it. Yeah, facts, facts. Cause also one thing is 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 that um people all around the world like see stuff like on the internet, yeah. on YouTube. Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, whatever. And if if you post today, um, most likely someone that saw that post today might not see the one that you post tomorrow. Right. So on YouTube, I think it's even a much, much better chance to do that because there's a lot of people on YouTube. There's a lot of people mm. watching videos every day. It's crazy. Sure, it's also a bag. It's just people don't really... Damn. They don't really dive into it like that. But What's it's fine. That? I think people need to catch up to, to bro, where it really... Bro, I want to take you back uh, mm-hmm. onto something. Are you aware that your uh, your EP with Zuchi Cold Dog job? <laughs> Damn. Damn. Are you hurting me on a, <laughs> on a Saturday <laughs> afternoon? <laughs> Yo. Mm, 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 mm. I'm nah. sorry. Nah, I'm aware, bro. I'm aware. And um, Aish, it is what it is. Because to be honest, um, those are only like, I think, five of the songs. Is it five? I'm not and too sure. Like, what, what hurts me about it is it's the worst versions of the songs. Like, Are you serious? Some of the songs are chopped. They don't have verses, <laughs> bro. I don't know why anyone would do that. The titles are not mine. The artwork is in me. Everything is just it's giving um, Zimbabwe, eh? It's giving Zimbabwe. But <laughs> the actual songs, hey man, they're there. They exist. They are there. There's a couple that hadn't even dropped. Oh yeah? So it's like, uh, it's cool, bro. Do you it's think really, you can still drop them? Uh at a certain point in time, not now, because the project was never done. So oh, yeah? it's like it doesn't make sense for me to then not finish it all. Should I do I should I drop it now? Nah, that ain't the wave. Cause we gotta we gotta finish the whole thing. If you listen to it, there's a certain direction to everything. Facts, right. Facts. Cause I feel like Zuji is such a good creator. Yeah, there was a direction to it yeah. all. And to put out half of it is weird and it doesn't make sense to me because it's like, why would you then just settle for this when yeah. it could have been a, a much better product, could have been a much better project. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. <laughs> niggas. Niggas will be niggas, man. <laughs> niggas will really be niggas, bro. I, and there's nothing you can do about it. Just gotta sit back and let it let it happen. But like how's the experience of just 
being being able to work with sushi. It was crazy. I won't lie. Oh yeah. Yeah, it was crazy. It was like today. It's one of the most fruitful things in my in my time of like making music with people. Yeah. My favorite sessions of all time, without a doubt. Um. Man, there was a lot to learn also. There's a whole lot to learn just seeing like how niggas cook up and, you know, just that, that also the discipline, you know, it gets different because every day we're used to like, ah, bro, I'm just gonna, you know, I'm gonna go to the studio. Yeah. Know, like it's cool. I, I will at some points, you know, I'll, I'll make a song at some points, you know, let me do the hook and just put it aside, you know, and then I'm gonna come back to the verse later. <laughs> there it was like, yo, lay down the hook. Oh, wait, it's done. Oh, wait, lay down the verse. Now, it's, oh, wait, it's done. just put the second verse on it. Now, oh, wait, okay, bad. The song is done. Like, <laughs> it's done. It's not like, it's ah, no, shit. we can relax, we can relax. Let's just chill. Uh-uh. While the beat is being made, you got to write the verse now. It's like, you hear. It was like, it was a cook, it was, it was a cooking. Yeah. Same spot. Yeah. Not like yeah. maybe he played you a few beats. No, no, no. He sent a couple beats initially. And oh, then, yeah. Most of them we had to cook up like either further than they were before, or we just had to just make like a song from scratch. So yeah, it was it was crazy. I don't lie. Like it's just a different level of discipline in my in my opinion. So I, I guess I picked that up as well. Um, also, then after that, then you start to see like other South African artists oh, yeah? and they cook up so much. If you look at Blackie, for instance. Yeah. Man, just be cooking. Like, Literally. Hey, man, just be cooking. In like, the kitchen, though. Every single. In the kitchen. Chance you get, you got to make sure you're making the record. But I feel like, I feel like the that's actually how, as an artist, it's supposed to be, you know? Yeah. yeah. You know, that daily cooking is the, is the one that actually gets you into the level of artistry that you need to be at. Yeah. Uh, what do they say about practice and perfect? <laughs> but whatever. Yeah, practice makes perfect. Yeah, yeah, that thing, that thing. Definitely, definitely. And it's, the only way you can really do that is having ample amount of studio time. Fact. Yeah, because it's going to pay for a session every every Friday or every day. So every it's day costly. would be crazy because every day you're paying about 500 Damn. To record a song. I don't know how much a studio now. Damn. I'm sure it's really costly. I, I won't even lie. Every day you're paying that, you're making a record, you're going home with it. You got to make sure you wrote it down before you get to the studio because you got an hour. Because you got an hour. On top of that, you can't talk. <laughs> man, you can't choke for shit. <laughs> what do you mean you're choking? <laughs> Time is going. Man. <laughs> don't play with us. <laughs> what do you mean? Why, and, why and, are you choking? And on top of that... It, it, the producer might not even do what she wants. Yeah. That's yeah, to sound yeah, like. Yeah. Your song might not sound the way that you want it to. I think, I think honestly, you need to, as an artist, you need to invest in your, your craft when it comes to equipment. Yeah. Um, being able to do the music without having to pay all those costs, you know, even yeah. if it's your homie, like type shit. Like, Link up with the homie. Make tune. Throughout, 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 throughout your, the whole timeline, bro. Yeah. Who do you think is one of the people that's been most inspiring? The most inspiring throughout my timeline? Does it have to be someone I know? It can be. Or someone you, you don't know. Most inspiring. Yo. Oh. Crazy. <laughs> crazy. Fucking crazy. Uh, someone that I watched that in, that inspired, um, I guess the thought you would say you you can really do this shit, like for real, for real. Nah, is Reese not like don't don't quote me because you guys you guys don't like Reese like that. But it's Reese. <laughs> <laughs> you know it what? is Reese because <laughs> of the way the way that he he came up, uh, and came up again. He's yeah. the only kid who's been on the block twice. Yeah, he came up and came up again. And after he came up again, killed it. <laughs> like they killed it so hard. Like they killed it so much. They also they also inspired the idea that you can do it with your homies, you know, that you can have a team together. Yeah. And we can all do it at the same time and keep it pushing. Everyone can do something. And 
we'll all make it, you know? And that's something to look up to and on light to you. Definitely oh, yeah? is, yeah. So Reese from afar. Um as people I know. I don't know, man. I don't know. I guess it's the homies that work like really hard. I know some really hard working homies. Like, for example, like Sean. Man works like men's working, bro. Man works extra hard, no lie. So it's like And it's paying off. Yeah, for sure. You have to so it's like people like that then also inspire the same thing, you know, the 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 thought that you you can can actually make it. If you work hard, then you can do it. You know, you can make it. Um hey. You know, <laughs> our, fav- our, fav- our favorite, our favorite, you know, um, we've seen craziest blow up of all time, bro. Yeah, that, that's bro, that's inspiring to that level. It's like you really can, same, you really can. Do it. Really, it is possible, bro. It's it really is possible. possible, it's really, really possible, super possible, super. Yeah, <laughs> everyone's a person, you know what I mean? You just need to do the right things, you gotta, you know. But we don't know how it's gonna happen for each and every one of us. It Facts. Might be different. Facts. Yeah, you might blow up doing but, something else. But like the thought of just waking up every day and knowing that your life can change in the moment. Yeah, that's the craziest part. Any second. Any could second. Be that. Literally, it could be the last second. You. Yeah. You living like this. Yeah. Yeah. You could go out the house, bro. And go <laughs> it's like, yo, old lady, I gotta see you. Dog. I'm gonna be out for at least the next six months. I'll be back. Like. I'll be a changed man by then, you know? And it's, it's really like that. You know, I feel like that's one of the things you need, you need to keep in the back of your head mm-hmm. as, as, as a creator. Yeah. As much as, you know, you run out of inspiration or you feel like it's not worth it or they're not paying you enough. But like that, that thought that it can literally happen any day. Yeah. Any day. Yeah, it really could, man. I won't lie. I won't lie. Like... And you have to be prepared when it does. Yeah, facts. It's also another thing. Because you could always just like it come at you and you don't know what to do with it. You could fumble. You, yeah, you could fumble. really fumble. And that's, 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 that's really why I felt like I had to then learn some things. Because I don't want to get to a point where I, I happen to come across something or I can't, I can't grab it or I fumble it. Facts. You know what I mean? So... You have to know how to move around. You have to bro, know the business as well. Bro, Amari, Amari, Amari is like that one nigga who's who's very educated, but he's reserved. That's how I look at it. Slightly, <laughs> yeah. slightly, slightly, S- slightly, man. Yeah. yeah, you gotta, you gotta insert coin. Facts, <laughs> facts. The game will pop up. Insert coin for game, man. You know what I'm saying? But it's not like that. I'm just saying, like. It's, it's not something I feel like I shouldn't be speaking to just everyone because, hey, bro, sometimes people just don't listen. They don't really take what you're saying. People are going through a lot, bro. You know? Yeah, you'll, you'll say something to someone, they just say, ah, dog, what do you know? Like, <laughs> it's fine, bro. Like, I don't have to hear from you. And it's, it's, it's valid, but it's like, ish, you really could gain a lot from just conversations. You can also learn from people, your peers. Same thing. Even if you feel like you're, Someone that knows a lot, you can learn from your friends. There's always something that you don't know. Facts. And they can tell you about it, yeah. So, shout out. Thank you. That's a, that's a deep compliment. I'm not going to lie. That's so <laughs> serious, man. That's so serious. No, shout out. Men's been always like this ever since. For real? Ever since. Ever since I knew Omar. And I was in primary when I knew this nigga. Yeah. In the, yeah. Hood. In the hood. In the hood. In the in hood. The, it was yeah. rough. Yeah. <laughs> This nigga left us. <laughs> Not even, bro. This Not nigga even. left. I just moved back to, to Brema. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm a Brema boy full time now. Ripping the city. Ah, bro, what city? Brema store. <laughs> what city, bro? Brema store. This Brema is the store. city, bro. Ripping the city. <laughs> hey, bro, go hard. Go hard. It's fine. Go hard. <laughs> Y'all can go hard. Y'all can go hard. But we're ripping the city out here. But, 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 uh, but I like that, man. I like that. Gosh, that. That, 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 that but call sign, you know. Yeah, you got to. And I feel like you, you also have to have your people behind you. Yeah, backing you up. Yeah, we don't have that. Niggas out there in America, they got Atlanta niggas, you know, they like, 
all my Atlanta homies, they gonna hold me down, you know, bro. my Chicago homies, if you're from bro. New York, then it's like your New York homies are always gonna hold you down. This side, you but trying to, side, <laughs> they trying to take a break. Uh, <laughs> they counting you out, dog. Oh yeah, nah, it's, it's rough, crazy. man. So it, I think it's important for us to rap where we're from. It's just, I felt like, you know, we got the, we got the name, you know, we got the, Got that fire. You got that fire. <laughs> I'm catching it though. Except, tell me, bro. Um, mm-hmm. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna to do this. I usually do this with all the artists I have on the segment. So okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna two, do two artists. You pick one. One has to go. Damn, crazy. Yeah. Okay. Um, crazy. What are we starting with? Let's do, let's do, Lanzo Madonna. Yo, that's <laughs> hard, bro. That's so hard. That is so Lance's hard. Lance's family, he'll understand. Madonna's family too, that's the thing. That's so hard. That's so hard. That is so hard. Can I come back to that one? I need Nigga to think no. about it. I need to, <laughs> I need to think about no. it. Oh, what happens if I don't pick? I don't know. I gotta do something if I don't pick. Yeah. If I don't pick. You call, I, call, you're calling your ex. I'm calling my ex. Yeah. If you don't pick, you're calling her. <laughs> and you're putting on the speaker. And I'm putting on the speaker. Yeah. Hey, bro, thing is, dog, I'm the type of nigga to really do that. I'm not scared. It's fine. <laughs> I'll pick. It's going to be so unfair. <laughs> so unfair. I'll call her like five times. I'll be out there like, yo, dog, they said I must call you again. Uh, thing is, bro, Lance and I make a lot of music together. It would be unfair if I said that, right? His family, he'll understand. Madonna. <laughs> I love Madonna. It would be unfair because it's like, I'm saying, you know, like, yeah, the homie that's right next to me, yeah, he's there. So he knows I fuck with him. So don't worry. We are chill. <laughs> <laughs> we are chill. All right, Lance out, Madonna <clears throat> in. Mm-hmm. Who's uh, next? Who's next? Sanilo O. Or... <clears throat> okay, yeah. Tricky. Sanilo or AZ. Uh, Sanilo. Sanilo. Yeah. Lyrical pastor or Young Zesh? Young Zesh. Damn. <laughs> it's yeah. tough. Yeah. Young um, Zesh. Young Tambo or... What can I compare Tambo with? Because... Ah! Young Tambo was to say hello. Young Tambo. Young Temple. Yeah, you come with the easy ones now. <laughs> I'm coming with the easy ones. With the easy ones. Easy ones. Easy ones. Which one, boy? Let's hit it. Let's hit it. Let's hit it with the far. The far. The far. Let's hit it with the far. Who? Who? Who else? OG King. OG King or Abel Kane? Um. Uh, Abel Kane. Abel Kane. Abel Kane. Yeah. 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 Fair. I'm dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair, 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 fair. That was fair, though. That, that was, was fair. fair. Yeah, it's fair. Yeah, it's fair. Not, not even like on some. Pay Pesha Super. Damn, bro. <laughs> that one is crazy. That one is crazy. That one is crazy. Yo, I've, seen, I've, seen, I've seen Super more than I've seen Pay Pesh play. Are you serious? Yeah. Like, I, I haven't been to that many shows. But, like... Like, as many as I, I've seen oh, Super. Oh, okay. Not that, that I'm sense. saying. Like, I haven't seen him that a lot. Sense. I have. I've seen him so many times. But I've seen Super play so many sets. Like, I've seen him kill it so many times. Like, so different ways, different flips. I have to go with Super. <laughs> <laughs> I have to. Yo, yo, he's yo, done we'll some crazy soup. things. Remember, remember Pop Sunday? Yeah. Come on, bro. Come Ish. on, come on, bro. Ish. And, and you, know what, you know what made it even even better for me? Because I asked him about it and he told me that the whole thing was impromptu. And I was like, I right, bet. For real? Bet. What? Bet. I was like, yeah, king. <laughs> it's too much. Too I much. know you went hard. So, no so, lie. so I think, I think, yeah, yeah. Super. Hard one, but yo. Shit. But hey, but, but, but it's a, it's a cheeky one. love, though. Yo, Baby Bash is fire as hell. Yo, Dog, he's hey, playing this play. Even the selection is crazy. Bro, this like, nigga played too crazy. Bryson Tiller Exchange. That's too crazy. Too Everybody crazy. started singing. Too crazy. But you see now, bro, if we talk about the songs you've seen them play, it's 
gonna be a little crazy, you know. Hey. It's gonna be a little bit crazy. Hey. Cause I, I've seen I've seen him do I've seen Super do flips of bad bitch so many times, like on different songs. Oh yeah. And I'm always like fascinated on that. But sheesh. 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 <laughs> Yo, 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 yo. Now they both fire. Tap, tap or or stand? Tap. His family, he'll understand. They count him out. Nah, I've also seen Tap so many times. That's oh, the thing. And yeah. I've seen him play hip hop. I've seen him play Afro beats. I've seen him play house. I've seen him play I'm a piano. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, so it's like he's a DJ all around type shit. Like on every bass. So I've seen it. Nasty. Nasty. Grizzly or who can I compare Grizzly with? Uh, uh, Grizzly or Blue Jay? Grizzly. 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 Y'all thought that was hard. Y'all, th- <laughs> Y'all thought that was hard. Shit, shit, shit. Damn. Yo, 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 yo. Y'all really came with that. It's, it's, it's gonna be the one. <laughs> the, Lara, hardest, the hardest one is Lara Lucian. <laughs> Lucian or Mosaic? <laughs> See now those ones are hard. Those ones are very, very hard. Those ones, <laughs> those ones are difficult. Oh, this calling that X. Oh, those ones are difficult. Those ones are so difficult. Like not even difficult to pick. It's just difficult to choose any. Okay. Laro on the first one? Laro or oh, Lucian? Laro. But the Lucian and Mosaic one? Yeah. X. Hey, so let me find my ex's number. <laughs> <laughs> let me find it. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> We're gonna, I'm going to have to go with Lucian. By default. Oh, yeah? yeah. By default. Yeah. Okay. By default. Let's do producers. Let's do producers. Um, Mesha Zuchi. Mash or Zuchi? Yeah. Zuchi. Hey, Zuchi any day. Hey, but Mash got crazy samples, though. Yo. Mash has crazy samples. Um, for sure. Hey, but, but Zuchi, boy. Zuchi got that range also. <laughs> hey, he got that range, bro. He could go from Zuchi's like, a fucking curator, boy. Yeah, he got that range. Yo. And he can rap. Hard. But, but do you think he's a better artist than as a producer? Um, it's, it's funny. I was having this chat the other day. I, uh, I would say the production is mad strong, like it's hard, like it's crazy. Like he's he's crazy with the production in comparison to like recording, but he's crazy with the recording though. Don't get it twisted. But like yo, the production, whoa, 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 it's too crazy. I'm thinking. Mm-hmm. Um, um, I want to go for a producer, a local producer. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, oh yeah, mm-hmm. oh yeah. I have one. We go hello. Oh, hello for sure. <laughs> yeah, oh, that was so easy. For <laughs> sure. <laughs> that was so easy. And that was so bro. easy. Yeah. <laughs> you cut me off guard. <laughs> that was so easy. Yo, shit, bro. And like, it's not. It's not even like based on skill. Like with all of these ones, it's like, bro. It's some some of the people just have like some crazy tunes where it's like, I don't know if you've had that. Yeah. That one record. You know what I mean? Like, hey man. Even the mixing, the production, the mixing, and mastering. Ed- Edge and Fool or Sanilo. Edge and Fool. Yeah. She got some new shit coming. Yo. Crazy. She's fabulous. She'll understand. Crazy. <laughs> crazy. Crazy. Bro. Crazy. I'm actually, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Mm-hmm. I don't know how I'm going to get there. But African Throne at Solanis. Oh, shit. And Mary's Live. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I yes, want to yes, be sir. there because I thought be, it was will love. Will this be out by, by the time? <laughs> will this be out by the time? Yeah. It will. Yeah. Oh shit! Like before on Monday. Show them on Monday. Let them know come your side. The show. Let oh. them know your side, boy. Come to the show. <laughs> Please come early. Come early. This thing of 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 people packing out the show. It's tough, guys. But I feel like Solanus is gonna be packed early. Oh, no, that's fine. It's plenty people. Packing out early, but it's a Friday also, so people gotta clock out. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. People have to clock out from crafts first, and then they're gonna pull up. But it's fine though. Um, I'm I know. Just, Friday, I'm just hoping the set time is dope. But 
Now nah, it's gonna be a vibe. It's rock. It's new records that I haven't performed at all. I'm so oh, yeah? jump. I'm, I'm, hey, I'm hey, really looking forward to that hey. like, live chat. Hopefully you can have some dances in that bit. Hey man, I wish. I wish. <laughs> I really wish. I, I wish. I wish. That would be nice. But like, you know, which dances are nice. The ones that you don't hire them. Like, they come from the crowd. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that is provide. <laughs> so let's get you calm, bro. Let's just get you calm, so just got you what's, calm what's about that. Slogan: uh, We are passionate. We are about passionate you. about you. Yeah, they real passionate. They're passionate about, about, about you. Don't, don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> Not trust. Ketamari, his life at Solanis on Friday for yeah. African Throne. Yeah, I married life because he thought it was love. I myself, Abdelmini, Lindelansi Milani. We out.